Two years ago, when St. Bonaventure's All-CIF quarterback Ricky Town was injured and out against powerhouse Alamany, the Seraphs turned to unheralded sophomore quarterback Darius Vines. Uh, playing quarterback my sophomore year, I uh, was a little nervous in the first game when I first played, but other than that, I know what to expect when I'm going back to quarterback. If he was nervous, he didn't show it, as he threw for 295 yards against the Warriors. Fast forward to 2015, and Darius is back at quarterback after leading the Seraphs in touchdown receptions last season as the number one option for town. Despite all the changes, he's had very few issues dealing with them. Uh, the transition has been good. I, uh, my footwork and everything was good for a uh, receiver, and that obviously carried on to quarterback. With that footwork and his strong arm, Darius's athletic ability on the field is what pops out in the minds of his coaches and teammates. Athlete, I mean, you know, and like in that true capital A sense, uh, just a very gifted athlete that can do anything he wants. I gotta say, I've never seen a kid like him. He, he can run, juke anyone out. <laughs> he has a great arm, probably the best I've seen in high school. And to be next to him in the backfield, is, it must be scary for teams. <laughs> Football is not the only sport that Darius excels at. He's also a star basketball and baseball player. He has scholarship offers for both football and baseball, but he's still undecided on his college path. Uh, I want to try and play both football and baseball, but if I can't, uh, I'm not sure yet. I don't know what I'll choose. When making that decision, he'll have a solid support system in his family helping him every step of the way. His older brother Randy was a defensive end at the University of New Hampshire from 2008 to 2012, and his older sister Deji plays basketball at Cal State Bakersfield. The Vines family patriarch, Randy Sr., says that the success of the older siblings is good motivation for Darius. It's, it's pretty much an a, a inspiration for him to compete at the level he's competing so they can kind of feel proud of him. You know, I, I wouldn't say it's a competition, it's, it's a helpful hand. As Darius tries to leave his own athletic legacy this year at St. Bonaventure, he has the knowledge that his family and teammates trust him to succeed in whatever he sets his mind to. The advice I can give him is to, to proceed and prosper as a young man and, and reach for his goals. For the CIF Southern Section, this is Antonio Venegas reporting from the Cronkite Sports Bureau in Los Angeles.